Second year Hopkinton Hillers girls varsity basketball head coach Mike Greco led his team to a postseason spot for the second straight time. Last year, the Hillers finished 15-7 and overall and advanced to the regional semifinals to fall to Notre Dame Academy. This year, the Hillers returned most of their core players and finished the regular season with an 18-2 and record and have a very good chance at the top seed in the Central Division II bracket. I recently caught up with Hillers head coach Mike Recco. All right, Coach, so um, first of all, congratulations on a great season, and it's looking like you're uh, probably going to have the number one seed. Uh, can you talk about um, this team and the season so far and, and uh, what your thoughts are heading into the playoffs? Sure, yeah, we're, um, we're, we're lucky to have great seniors, great leadership. This team has done absolutely everything asked of them all year. They've played tough, they've played through injury, um, you know, one of the special things about it that I keep telling them is that we've got really invested role players. You know, our, our bench has been phenomenal, giving us great energy, um, and our seniors have given us tremendous leadership. You know, so we're, we're lucky we're 18 and 2. We're going in as either the one or the two seed to the tournament, so it um, should be a lot of fun. Now, with 18 and 2, I can't imagine there's uh, too many imperfections with this team, but can you talk about some of the things that you're working on? Uh, always turnovers and poise, um, you know, making sure that we're taking care of the basketball, making sure that uh, we show poise and composure in pressure situations. Um, there's a lot of big games coming up, there's going to be a lot of big moments coming up. Um, you know, and again, that's what we're lucky to have such strong leadership at the top uh, with our seniors and our captains that, you know, kind of keeping everybody settled down and, and under control in some of those big moments. And the core of this team has played together for a while for the most part. Uh, can you talk about the chemistry with this team? It's phenomenal. Uh, we returned 11 players. Um, they are about the closest knit group that I think I've ever seen. You know, every time I come in to practice, they're all huddled around talking. You know, about the bachelorette or whatever it is. Um, you know, we we had a team function the other night, and uh, you know, they're they're just laughing it up and, and having a great time together. I got to ask you about the Medway game because it was quite interesting. You're down 23 to six after the first quarter, but it seems yeah. like the the team kept their cool and really never lost faith. That was a big moment for us. Uh, Medway, to their credit, came out fired up. They shot lights out early on in the first quarter. Uh, they had us back on our heels a little bit. Um, and again, I think it's a testament to the mental toughness these girls have shown over the course of the season that they were able to sort of, you know, refocus, you know, gather themselves together, recommit to defense, recommit to taking care of the basketball and, um, you know, kind of chip away at it and, you know, get it with close with it, you know, by halftime and then uh, we were able to take the lead there in the third quarter. Well, Coach, we're looking forward to the uh, playoffs and we hope that it's a very long run. Thank you. Us too. Us too. Appreciate it. Senior captain Michaela Pucci played a key role during the Hillers Volleyball State Championship season this past fall. This season, she has also continued to flourish on the basketball court. In the Hillers' previous game against Medway, Michaela led the team with 16 points. I asked her thoughts on the season. Can you talk about the season that uh, you've had so far and what it's been like playing with this team? It's been a great season. We've had so much fun together on and off the court. We've been working hard all season and everything's paying off at the end of the season and we're having a great time. This year's state champion Hillers volleyball team featured many members of the girls basketball team. I asked Captain Michaela Pucci about the chemistry of this year's team. Yeah, it's been a great senior year with um, both sports, but um, having like the same girls and we're a lot of them are the same from last year, so we just have great chemistry and we are finally working really well together on the court and it's great to see. I caught up with junior Ivy Gogolin, who has had a breakout season for the Hillers. I've loved it. Um, from the beginning of the season, every day, everyone has the same goals, so we come in ready to improve and it's been great. I love these girls and it's been a fun season. All right, and uh, what do you think the um, main reason is uh, for the success of this team? Why would you say you guys are 18-2 and, and more than likely going to be a one seed in the playoffs? 
I think you definitely have to credit a lot of it to coaching. We have great coaches. Coach Greco and both our assistants, Coach Chatton and Coach Baldiga, have really been pushing us all season and we push each other and I think our attitude, I think we all are really excited about the season. We want to go all the way, so that definitely helps. Senior guard and captain Emma Lakasha also has enjoyed playing with this year's team. I mean, we're all we're all like best friends, so it's the best time. I mean, we spend literally every day with each other, <laughs> multiple hours a day, so it's been the best season so far. All right, it seems like uh, your game has come a long way uh, coming into this season. Uh, what are some of the things that you were working on uh, throughout the year? Uh, we all, I mean, from all of us, uh, we all play in the off season, so just... <laughs> <laughs> all right, we're good. <laughs> no, we just all, I mean, I know every single one of us put in the work and work on our skills and work on what we know how to do and how to do it better and um, just to make our team better as a whole, yeah. All right, and I'll ask this one for all of you. What are your hopes heading into the postseason? Um, what, do you look, what are you looking to accomplish? What, uh, what must you accomplish to not be disappointed? Well... I make it as far as we can, but we got big goals. Stay chance times two this year, so let's go. Stay chance. <laughs> Definitely stay chance. <laughs> all right, well, thanks a lot. We wish you all the best of luck in the playoffs, and we look forward to seeing you. Thank you.